on YouTube. So I'm coming to you one week post, almost one week, Friday will be one week post my uh, re-tightening. And I just wanted to show you, you know, because my hair's down today, it wasn't down my last video, what it, what it looks like. Um, uh, if you're new to the channel, this is a lock channel for people who have thin hair, um, who interlock, who like to keep it simple, and yeah, that's about it. So yeah, I'm interlocked. I don't palm roll. Interlocking is when you take the hair and you loop it in on itself, so you kind of like um, inter um, interwove the fibers from the base out as it grows. So as it grows, you keep interlocking it from the base. Um, instead of palm rolling where you're taking the fibers and you're forcing them to roll into each other and create that lock, interlocking is taking those fibers and you're kind of like weaving them into themselves at the base so you're growing the lock out. And it also eventually will, the fibers will mat together but you're kind of like speeding along the process. And that's good for people who have thin hair or who sweat a lot. Because if you palm roll, you spend your good aid between 80 and $100 to get your retwist and then you sweat and then poof it just all comes out although your hair will still mat and eventually lock it just it just defeats the purpose so interlocking just helps that process along and through consultation and work with the loctician they'll help you pick a lock style i mean a lock technique that works best for you and that won't work best for me i did originally start out with palm rolling and that didn't work out too well so um interlocking is where where I ended up and, I, and I'm a year into locking and I like it. I was going to a brother lock technician and that just means you get to call them brother locks and they charge you more money and they're not available when you need them. <laughs> so I left her and went to a regular loctician who just specializes in locks and the maintenance of locks and lock care and all of that good stuff. And she charged me um, market value. And I like the service I get. I like the simple products she used. And bada bing, bada boom. So here we are. Um, like I said, I got my locks retightened on Friday. Interlock locks never quite fully have that really palm roll look. They always have, they tend to have a um, the slight fuzziness to them. That's the nature of uh, interlocks. You know, the fibers are left to stick out. Um, and, and over time, they will eventually smooth out. But I love my locks. I love them so much. I love the uh, color that I've achieved. Uh, in some of my older videos, I, I talk about how I've done that. I didn't use dye. I used a really mild all natural method to get the color in my hair. You can go back and check that out. Um, right now, it's the winter time, so my hair is, is a little dry, so I have to stay conscious of that. Um, I don't like to put a lot of oil in it. Um, I use a little spray oil on the scalp, like every other night. But other than that, I kind of keep things, you know, Regular, I used to put a lot of oils and waters and all that stuff, but it, all that do is tend to run down your face and mess up your skin and just make your um, follicles clogged up and it really doesn't really do too much. So your hair will naturally oil itself. You just kind of help to help the process along after washings because you tend to wash off your natural oils so your hair is a little dry and it becomes itchy. But once um, your oil glands fill back up and, and it starts to work as it naturally should, you, don't, you can cut off the extra oil I've noticed for myself, you know, you do what works for you. Um, but yes, yeah, so I just wanted to come back uh, a week out um, from my retightening just to show you guys what it looks like. Um, I'm going to do a rotation so you can see the back and then I'm going to get out of here. So I keep looking at the wrong way. I should be looking here, here. All right, so this is the front. side this the back I said this the back
It's the other side. I said this the other side. Just in case you can't hear me. And it's the front. The bear's growing in. It's a little, little homeless person. I have a really sp spacey beard, but once it grows in, I'm going to comb that over there. I'm going to pick that up and I'm going to comb that over there. So I'm, I'm going to cover up that spot right there. I'm going to comb that over there. It's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be good. So just, you know, I'm trying to hang in there. But in the meantime, peace and blessings, um, happy growing, and I'm out of here.